Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Um, today I wanted to share with you guys some of my favorite drugstore nude lip liners. Um, I don't know, I feel like a nude lip liner, well, I don't know, for me anyways, it's not something that you need to spend a lot of money on. For me, it's all about the color, and if I can find a good pinky, beigey, nudie lip liner, I am just in love, and I'm all for it. So, I'm going to go ahead and get started. At the end of the video, I'm going to uh, post a swatch with MAC Royal, so you guys can see that some of the colors are even comparable to a higher-end brand, and you don't have to spend a lot on lip liners to get a great color. So, stay tuned. Alright, so I'm going to start off with one of my favorite drugstore brands. This is a Milani lip liner. This is in the shade Nude. Um, their formulation is so good and they're so pigmented. Um, and the, the colors are really great. I feel like they have a lot of good um, nude options. Um, and this color is actually the color that is um, I hear a lot is comparable to Candy K, um, one of Kylie Jenner's lip kits. Um, it's just a great pinky, mauve nude neutral. So, there it is. And next up we have a couple of NYX liners. NYX is one of my favorite brands for lip liners. They just have, also like Milani, such a good um, range of colors. Um, and the first one is, oh, this is probably my favorite lip liner. This is in Peekaboo Neutral. Oh, it's just such a good pink. It's like a perfect pinky, beigey, neutral, everything I love in a nude lip liner color. And it lasts a really long time too, so that's great. The only thing I don't love is that, um, you know, you have to sharpen. I do love a good retractable liner, but it doesn't bother me because the color is just so good. Another one up from NYX is um, in Nude Pink. Um, this is a great um, everyday nude pink color. Sometimes I actually wear this by itself because it's just the color is so great and it's so creamy. That is Nude Pink. Okay, and another actually um, nude pink, it's actually called nude pink as well, is from the brand Giordana. This is one of their pencil liners. Um, I actually got this at Primark. I don't know if you guys have a Primark by you, one just opened by us, and it is just the best store ever. Oh my gosh. It's almost like an H&M um, with like cheap prices and trendy clothes and accessories, but the prices are so good and it's just so organized. Oh, I'm just obsessed. But, um, so here's Nordan. Uh, uh, Jordana in Nude Pink. Um, again, a perfect um, nudie pink. It's a little bit more mauve than the NYX uh, Nude Pink. Okay, and then we have two from Rimmel. I love um, Rimmel's um, lip liners as well. This is in their Exaggerate um, lip liner brand. I think this was a little more expensive than the actual pencil. Their pencil lip liners, I think they're like $6.99, but the color's really... Um, Really nice, really creamy. This is in East End Snob. Um, love this color as well. I wear this a lot with um, White Russian, the Buxom White Russian, which I love. And I also wear this alone as well, too. Really, really super creamy. It lasts a long time, too. I feel like I say that a lot, but a lot of these are really good. They last a long time. Um, all right. Sorry, I'm like going out of the range of the camera. Um, all right, so next up we have another um, Rimmel. This is in their Lasting Finish line. Um, this is, again, like I said, the, this is on the cheaper side. They're, I think this one, I want to say it's like $3.99, maybe not even that expensive. Um, there it is in, this is the shade Natural. Okay, and then I have two more from NYX. Um, these are um, their Slide On, Glide On lip liners. The first one I have is probably, it's a close tie with Peekaboo Neutral from NYX. Um, this is called Nude Suede Shoes. Oh my god, you guys, this is such a good color. It's, it can literally go with any lip, lip color. It's so perfect. There is Nude Suede Shoes. Okay, and then next up, same lip liner we have um, in Bed Rose. Um, this is like the perfect everyday pink. Also can go with a lot of different pinky, pinky nude colors. Uh, a little more pink than nude suede shoes. Um, the formulation in the, of, of these is really super creamy and I feel like they last a long time. I do feel like I go through these pretty quickly because the, um, the formulation is so creamy, but that's okay because I'm obsessed with these. Okay, and I think I have two more from Wet n Wild. Um, these are their gel lip liners, um, retractable lip liner. I think this is a, this is a new, newer lip liner from them. 
Um, this first shade is in Bare to Comet. Um, this is a good, good, perfect neutral. Um, this is comparable probably to Peekaboo Neutral. This is a really, really nice color. Um, love this. I have another gel lip liner from NYX. Um, this is in their shade Never Petal Down. Um, good everyday pink, comparable to Bedrose, I would say. Yeah, that's such a great color. Love that. Um, I really like these gel lip liners. Um, they're great pigmentation. The only thing with them, I feel like they don't last. They don't have great staying power, but I don't mind that because, yeah, the colors are really good in these, and like I said, I'm all about the color for a good nude lip liner. Um, and I think I have two more from Jordana. Um, so these are Jordana Easy Liners. Um, this is in the shade Rock and Rose. Um, this is more of a mauve mauve pinky pinky nude. This, I feel like, is the closest dupe to MAC Neutral. Um, MAC Neutral? Yeah, no such thing. Sorry, guys. I meant MAC Whirl. Um, it looks exactly like the color. Um, great, great color. Also can go with a lot of different lipsticks. Um, and then I have one more in Jordana. This is in the color Rose Crush. This is a kind of a brighter pink. It's probably the lightest I have. Um, but I love this for a good light um, nude neutral lip. Love that. So, yeah, I think that is all I have for you guys. Let me just make sure. I think so. I think I got them all. And here are the swatches I promised. So, to me, it looks like NYX Nude and Rock and Rose are probably the closest to Macworld. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, stay tuned um, to my channel if you want to see more reviews. I'm going to post a lot of short, quick videos because, I don't know, I feel like when I search YouTube, I'm always looking for like a quick product review and I don't feel like seeing a long, a long haul or um, makeup try-on, which I mean, I love those videos too, but I also like some quick reviews. So if you want to see more review videos, um, stay tuned.